Hi, very good morning students. Let us look into the next topic and very, very important topic called sequence detector. Okay, so this is a short, short question. You will definitely get one question from sequence detector. You may get a question like this. Draw the state diagram of sequence detector which detects sequence 0100. Only change will be they will give a different sequence. Okay, but the question remains same. Okay, you can draw or you can design the sequence detector either in melee approach or more method. If you design it using melee method, you need n states for designing a sequence detector. If it is more method, you need n plus 1 state. Okay, so let us start this uh, question. Let us see how to design this state uh, sequence detector which detects a sequence 0, 1, 0, 0. Let me design using melee method, okay? Now see, in melee method, you know how many states you need? N states. So see the sequence 0, 1, 0, 0. Since there are 4 is the length of the sequence, number of states is 4, clear? Depending upon the bits, if length of the sequence 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, if there are 5 bits, then length, number of states is 5. Since in this question, you have 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, I need value of n is 4, I need 4 states, done. Let us see the first step. Very easy way of designing it. Only thing is you need to focus. Let us start with the step 1. Now I need to detect a sequence detector that... A design a sequence detector that needs to detect a sequence 0, 1, 0, 0. Okay. Since there are 4 bits, number of states is 4. First step is write the sequence. How will I write the sequence? How many states I need? 4. So write the states. A, B, C, D. So there are 4 states. A state, B state, C state, D state. So from A state, when I move to B state, if A is 0. So from A state, when I move to B state, when A is 0. Okay. From B state, when I move to C state, when B is 1. So when B is 1, I move to C state. From C state, when I move to D state, when my C is 0. So when my C is 0, I move to D state. This is my first step. Clear? Write four states A, B, C, D. So when I move from A to B, I move from A to B, when my A is what? 0. When A is 0, I move to B. When my B is 1, I move to C. When my C is 0, I move to D. This is my first step. Okay. The first state is called as reset state or ideal state or you can call it as initial state. Okay. So, we will write a aromat and say this is reset state or ideal state or it is an initial state. Done. Let us go to step 2. What is my step 2? Write the sequence with output. Here I have written the sequence. Now I need to write the sequence with output. Let us see how to write it. When my output will be 1. When I detect complete sequence, my output will be 1. What is complete sequence? When I detect 0, 1, 0, 0. Only then my output will be 1. Till that point, wherever I am, whether it is 0 or 1 or 0, my output will be 0. When I get my output 1, only when I detect complete sequence. That is why we say sequence detector means what? It produces an output 1. Only when it required pattern is detected. Only when it detects the pattern, it produces output 1. So whether it is 0 or 1 or 0, whatever be the input it is, the outputs are 0. When I get 0, 1, 0, 0, only then my output will be 1. Till that point, whatever it is detected, here 0 is detected. Here 0, 1 is detected. Here 0, 1, 0 is detected. Since 0, 1, 0 is not sufficient, when I get my output 1, when I get 0, 1, 0, 0, I get my output 1. So now have I written the sequence with output? Yes. Now what I will do? I need to go for next one. What is the next one? Below the, after your initial state, can you see after your initial state, below every state write a small box. Okay. After writing a small box, what is that you need to write inside that box is from A to B, when you will move, when I detect 0, when I detect 0, only then I move from A to B. So, write that 0. 
from B to C when you will move when I detect 0 1 only then I move from A, A to B and B to C so here when I will move when I detect 0 and 1 okay what I will write in this box when I will what I will write in this box when I detect 0 1 and 0 only then I move to C to D okay so what is that uh, uh, we need to do in step 3 write the bit which is detected inside the box so what is that I will write inside the box the bit which is detected what is detected 0 what is detected here 0 and 1 what is detected here 0 1 0 it means part of the sequence 0 1 0 clear now what is my step 4 step 4 is complete diagram will come now let us see how this complete diagram comes. We have written, written part of this. Can you see we have done how I move from A to B, how I move from B to C, how I move from C to D is same. Yes. So I have done with part of this. What is the next thing I need to do? Let me tell you. Now for every state, you know whether it is melee or more, for every state there will be two inputs. One is zero input, other one is one input. I need to say if 0 is an input, what I will do? Will I go to, I will be in the same state or will I go to next state? That I need to say. So now every state, let me start with state A. Okay. For every state, I need to say for this input, whether I will be in the same state or I will move to next state. Now you know this is state A. Every state will have 0 input and 1 input. Can you see? In state A, I know if 0 is an input, what I do? If 0 is an input, what I do? I go to B. If 1 is the input, what I do? I will be in the same state. Since I have done the transition in 0, if 1 is the input, I will be in the same state. Okay. So, this is my input. What will be the output? Since it is not complete sequence, output will be 0. Now, come to B. In B, you know, every state will have 0 and 1. Now, in B, what you need to do is, every state will have what? 0 and 1. You have this box here right you have det what is that you will write inside the box what is detected zero is detected you will write in the box this is continuation of this now what you need to write is next step whatever is there in the box write it down just below it zero is there in the box so write zero here now i know b imagine this is b b will have zero state and one state B will have what state? 0 state and 1 state. I know if it is 1, I am going to C. But I don't know if it is 0, what I will do. So, what is left? B1 is there. B0 is left. So, write 0 here. Is it clear, students? So, I know when B is 1, I will go to C. But I don't know if B is 0, what I will do. So, I write that 0 here. If the 0, which is written at the last, matches with the bit which is inside the box, if it matches, say stay in the same state. That is rules. See the rules here. If it is a match, stay in the same state. Since 0 and bit inside this box is same, I will be in the same state. If B is 0, I will remain in the same state. Output default is 0. Now come to C. So, what is there inside the box? 0, 1. Write as such. 0, 1. 0, 1. Write it as such down. Okay. Now, what you need to do? You know, C, C will have what? 0 and 1. I know if C is 0, I have to go to D. What is left? I should know what happens if C is 1. So, what is that I need? I need to know what if c so i will write that one here so zero one is written as such down then what bit i have to know i need to know if c is zero i know i need i will go to d i need to know if c is one what i will do so write that one here here first compare only one bit because only one bit is sitting here so compare one bit here two bits are sitting here so compare two bits zero one compare with one one since these two doesn't match no match go to reset state first you have to check here zero one 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 no match leave it then after checking this match check 
the previous state also what is there inside this box zero what is here only one bit zero what is there one bit at this last corner what is the last least significant bit one so compare this least significant bit one with the previous bit zero since bo it is also not a match what do you need to do i will not go what is that i need to do if there is no match go to reset state since there is no match i need to go to which state reset state you know a is called as reset state so from c i will go to reset state a when my c is 1 when my c is 0 i go to d when my c is 1 where i will go i will go to reset state how will i do that first i need to check with what first i need to check the least significant bit last two bits with the box 0 1 1 1 no match then immediately what i need to do i need to check with the previous one this is one bit zero check compare with last bit one zero and one no match since there is no match what is the rule go to the reset state go directly to reset state okay input is one when c is one output is zero now come to d come on come to d what is that you need to write inside d you know d is 0 1 0 so take that 0 1 0 write the 0 1 0 as such term so in d we don't have any state so i need to write if d is 0 what i will do d is 0 what i will do d is 1 what i will do so if i will write this d as such can you see it is 0 1 0 0 the 0 1 0 is written as such now i need to identify if d is 0 what i will do if d is 1 what i will do right okay now let us start the comparison let us start with the first thing okay what are how many bits are there inside the box three bits so 0 1 0 i will compare with this three bits clear so 0 1 0 0 1 0 i will compare with what 1 0 0 is it a match no since it is no match what is that i need to do i need to go to the previous comparison i will compare 0 1 with 0 since two bits 0 1 is compared with 0 0 0 1 is compared with 0 0 no match since it is not matching what i will do i will again compare with the previous one single bit 0 is compared with extreme corner bit lsb 0 so there is a match if there is a match what i will do i will stay in the same state so since there is a match what i do i will stay in the same state when i will stay in the same state if my d is 0 if my d is 0 i will stay in the same state can you see now what is happening what is the sequence 0 1 0 0 0 1 0 0, 0, 0. if i detect 0 1 0 0 my output will become what 1 clear yes then i detect complete sequence zero can you see zero one zero and zero what will be my output one now this is done now what d what happens to the d if it is one i have done with zero what happens to the d if it is one so what i will do can okay, first what i need to do i take the three bits compare with the last three bits zero one zero i will compare with what one zero one is it a match no 0 1 0 1 0 sorry 1 0 1 not a match so go do compare with the second one 0 1 0 1 there is a match it means if there is a match what is that you need to do if there is a match stay in if there is a match stay in that state can you see if there is a both are matching if there is a match stay in that state so since it is matching if there is a match stay in that state so since it is matching with 0 1 0 1 0 belong to c go to that c if it is 0 b in your state if it is not a match uh, if this is a match what you need to do stay in that state so i need to go and stay in that state so if it is a 1 output your output is 0 you know yeah, when you will get output 1 one, only when you detect a sequence what 0 1 0 and 0 so this is how you need to draw the state diagram 
give uh, state diagram the question is draw the state diagram of a sequence detector which detects 0 1 0 0 this is the steps for detecting the sequence detector so first step draw the sequence second step draw the sequence with the outputs what is the third step draw the rectangular boxes and write the bit which is detected 0 is detected, 0, 1 is detected, 0, 1, 0 is detected. After this, now write the transition. Tell for each state, you will have two inputs, 0 input and 1 input. If it is 0 input, where you are moving. If it is a 1 input, where you are staying. This will be happening based on this rule. What is the rule? No match. If there is no match at all, then you need to go to which state? Reset state. If there is a match, you have to stay in that state based on this we are drawing this diagram clear so uh, this is about sequence detector using melee method thank you